Hey guys, how's it going? It is Mr. Crayfish and welcome. Welcome back. Uh, a big welcome back for me. Um, because where have I been? Where have I been? I'm going to explain to you guys in a another video. In this video today, guys, I'm going to be showing you guys some updated progress on the device mode because a lot of a lot has changed so today we are checking out a working printer inside of minecraft and who is calling me who is calling me hello but as i mentioned we are checking out a working printer in minecraft it is awesome because you can actually print out pictures and not only that you can put them up on your wall, kind of like custom artwork. So you can actually design it, print it, put it up on your wall for everybody to see. It will 100% blow your mind. And if it doesn't, I owe you cheese and crackers. If it doesn't blow your mind, let me know in the comments and I'll, I'll send you some cheese and crackers for free. All right? So we're all good here. But let's go ahead. Let's check this out now. So here we are at my beautiful mansion. Now you guys know I've been away for a couple of months. So you can imagine that my mansion might not be in the best condition. I did, however, tell young Greg, if you don't know who young Greg is, he's my pet dog in this world. He's my pet dog in this world. I told him to upkeep it, and it looks like he hasn't really done a good job. Like, look at this. There's spider webs everywhere. There are spider webs literally everywhere. My mailbox is still on the roof. Um, still haven't got that down. Uh, we're going to have to get that down in the future. Let's see if young Greg's in here. Ah, young Greg. I haven't seen you in a while. Oh, hey, how you doing? Is you doing good? You been you been behaving yourself while I've been gone? Where's Sir Piggles? You're still on the roof. What the? Sir Piggles, you guys remember this? You guys remember this? He was like possessed. He must be still possessed. How come he he's been up there for like three months? What the flip? How has he been? How has he been eating? You've been throwing pieces of bacon up to him from time to time? Oh, okay, that makes sense. Alright, so he seems to be eating still. He seems to be eating bacon, which I don't know why. That He's eating his cannibalism. But let's go ahead, let's check out this printer now. I'm not even going to ask what happened to my kitchen. I'm not even going to ask. That is something else. Literally, hashtag rip kitchen, everybody. Hashtag rip kitchen here. And we're going to head upstairs. Do you want to come, young Greg? Maybe you want to see this. Maybe you want to see this. I don't know how this printer got into my house um, even though I was like I literally just came back here um, it just appeared here and young Greg said, called me to come home he said you know we got a new printer I put a new I put a new printer inside your office up here come up oh my god what are you doing what are you doing he must be seeing things guys he must be he's all right oh yeah young Greg you can stay down there you can stay down there you don't want to see this amazing stuff so here it is guys, so you guys already know the laptop, if you haven't, if you don't know what the laptop is, check out the card uh, at the top right of the video right now, click on that and it will give you guys an overview of the laptop, I'm not going to do it in this video because it will literally make it an hour video, so definitely go check that out, um, but here is the printer and um, yeah, let's get straight into this, so the first thing that we need to do is actually fill it up with some paper. Um, so right now it actually has five pieces of paper in it. We can actually go ahead, grab some more out here, and we can pop this in one by one, or you can actually shift right click and it'll put, put as many as it can into it up until 64. So you can store 64 pieces of paper into this. Now it's not finished as I'm currently recording this video, there are still more features I'm going to be adding to this, so if you have any ideas for this printer, do let me know down in the comments below. Um, but we filled it up with some paper now, it doesn't require any ink at the moment, but that will be different in the future. We're going to go ahead and uh, head on to the laptop here, let's sit down. Where did young Greg go? You, you, you better seek a cheese and crackers stash? What the? Hey! Get down from there! Oh no, 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 no. Don't touch them, alright? All right, you, you can stay there. Just don't touch those cheese and crackers, all right? All right, young Greg's weird. Young Greg is very weird. Uh, but here we are. We're in the computer. Boom! It's lighting me up. Can you see? I'm like, I'm glowing now, guys. I am glowing. Look at me. I'm all, I'm all, I'm glowing. I'm gold. Um, but here we are. So what we're going to do is head into Pixel Painter application here. Now, you guys know about this already. Uh, we're going to go ahead and we're going to load up a picture that I created beforehand. Um, because I want to show you guys what you can do with this. So we got a cactus, a Mario, a Pokeball. We might go ahead and get the Mario straight out here. 
So here it is, the Mario that we created, and you might notice on the side here, we now have an extra button, and it has a little print icon on it. Let's go ahead, let's click on that print icon, and we're going to select a printer. Now, this is a list of all the printers that are in the area. Whatever's at the top is the most closest one, so the only one around is the one next to our laptop right now, so I'm going to click on that. Uh, we can see some information about how much paper it has and the location of it as well, just in case you can't find it for some reason. Uh, but we're going to go ahead, we're going to click on print here, and listen to this guys, listen to this. Can you guys hear that? Can you guys hear that? It is actually making... I think it's making a print sound, hold up. It definitely is. It's making a print sound when it's actually printing there. And have a look at that. The picture actually printed out while we were actually watching it print there. How cool is that? And what you can do now is actually hang it up on the wall. So we might put it over right here next to our uh, office area. What? Young Greg! It's dangerous out there. What the? What is he? What is he doing? Young Greg, get off there. Don't jump, please. Don't jump, please. All right, you can come back this way. Uh, there's something. There's, so, there's something definitely wrong with Young Greg. If you guys know what's got on going on with Young Greg, because I haven't been here for a while, maybe you guys might know. Maybe you guys have done something to him. Let me know if you did something to him, because he's acting a little bit strange. Uh, but we can go ahead and we can place this paper on the wall here. Boom! Have a look at that. Have a look at that. We got Mari up on the wall here, and it's basically like a custom artwork that you design, you can design yourself in Pixel Painter. How cool, how amazing is that? Just seriously, how amazing is that? Um, but not only that, I'm about to blow your mind now, and I said I was going to blow your mind. This has probably already blown half of your mind out. I'm going to blow the rest of your brain out right now. So. We've got this uh, Mario here, and what we're going to do now is grab these shears here out of the chest. We're going to open up this crafting table, pop that in, pop this in, grab that, and now we have a cut out version of this Mario um, picture that we created. So, yeah, I don't know what young Greg's doing. I really don't know what he's doing. But we're going to get rid of this one, and we're going to place one, place this cut out version down. Now, so if you guys think this is absolutely awesome, make sure you go ahead and snap that like button. We need it snapped right in half. And if you want to keep up to date with all my latest videos, make sure you go ahead, go ahead and subscribe. I suggest as well you press that post notification button so you definitely get notified when I post new videos. Let's go ahead, let's do this now. Boom! Skier! Have a look at that. That is absolutely amazing. That is so cool. You can actually put like custom artwork on your walls now that actually like, it looks cool. How cool does that look? Just look at that. How cool does that look from a distance there? Imagine having like tons of pieces of art all around your room, custom made by yourself, or you can even, you know, copy up other things if you want to. So obviously this is Mario. I didn't create him. I copied him. I'm, a, I'm bad at pixel art sometimes. I'm not good at creating characters. So we're going to use good old Mario here uh, to put on our wall. Young Greg. I don't know. If you, uh, I'm not even, I'm not even going to talk about him anymore. I'm not even going to talk about him anymore. Uh, but we've got a couple more pictures that we're going to print off here uh, to show you guys. So let's go ahead. Let's get pixel paint. Let's print off uh, this cactus here. Looks pretty cute. Now you can actually queue up pictures as well. So we can go ahead, get this Pokeball out, uh, print that at the same time, and straight after this one's printed, it will actually start printing out the Pokeball as well. So we got the Mario. Uh, we'll cut this one out as well because we can. Um, so that's the cactus, that's Mario, and then we should finally get here um, the Pokeball. Now, a good little Bit of, bit of a technical thing for those people out there that like more technical stuff. So pretty much um, the speed that the printer pit prints out is based on the resolution of the picture. So these are 16 by 16 images, so it's going to take 16 seconds. Um, and then, you know, for anything high, it'll take 32 seconds, 64 seconds, and so on. Uh, so we can place these down, but as you can see, they're not cut out. They're not cut out. So let's go ahead, let's cut these out. 
So the cactus, put it back there, and then also the Pokeball. So there we go, we've cut those pictures out. We can now pop them along here. Let's actually put them at the top here. I think that will look really cool. Damn! Have a look at that. That looks so sweet. I actually personally haven't tested this out properly and now testing it out properly. That just looks so cool and I'm just excited. I'm excited to see what you guys actually create um, using this mod. Now, you're probably asking yourself right now, where can I get a download link? Well. I'm gonna be put, like I'm not I'm not straight as this video goes up. If you're watching this as soon as it goes up, it's not gonna be there. But if you're here a couple of days later, so make sure you come back to this video, guys. Make sure you come back to this video. I'm gonna put a download link in the description because I feel like you guys you guys deserve it. I've been away for a while. I want you guys to start having some fun. Um, Christmas is coming up, so this is like a early Christmas present for you guys. I want to see what you guys can create with this amazing mod. So make sure you check in the description below for the download link. If it's not there yet, make sure you come back later on and uh, check if it's up or not. Uh, but yeah, how crazy is that? Let me know in the comments what you guys think um, of this printed. If you have any ideas, do let me know in the comments below. Young Greg, do you like it? I need to get him back inside. Can we? Can, young Greg, get in here. I'm gonna have. Am I gonna have to? Okay, this is gonna be the. All right, he's, he's all good. He's he's fine. He's fine. We just had to do a little bit of a. Um, it was Plan B. It was Plan B, guys. The Plan A wasn't gonna work. I told him to come in. This is Plan B. He's learned his lesson now, haven't you? All right, you stay here. You're you're not allowed to go up on that roof anymore. All right, you're not allowed to go up on that roof. You still got. He's still got the cheese and crackers from last time. He still hasn't ate them. What is he saving it for? Maybe we'll find out in the future what he's saving it for, but he's still got that cheese and crackers on him. I thought it would have gone off. I thought it would have gone off after a couple of months, but seems like, seems like it's still, it's still fine. I mean, that's cheese and crackers for you. Now, I don't want to end off this video straight away. I want to make it a little bit longer for you guys because, you know, I haven't done one of these videos in a while. Um, I really miss it now that I'm actually recording right now. And what I'm going to do is create a brand new painting. So. Uh, let's go ahead. Let's do something a little bit different. Let's do a 32 by 32. All the other ones I've shown you so far um, are 16 by 16. But I think what we're going to do is we're going to paint the Mona Lisa. If you guys don't know what the Mona Lisa is, uh, you're living under a rock because it's probably one of the most, it's probably the most famous painting out there. I would have to say it's the most famous painting, arguably. Arguably, it's the most famous painting. So I'm gonna go ahead and just grab a picture of this up on my phone. Show me pictures of the Mona Lisa. Check out these pictures. Thank you. All right, now that we've got this picture up on my phone, I'm gonna recreate it perfectly. And if you guys don't agree with my artwork, then get out of here, it's art, it's art, all right. So, first of all, we need to get a basic shape here of our head. Um, that's pretty good! <laughs> um, let's give her some skin. She's a bit yellow because I think it's just because of the painting. If you guys like my art skills, let me know. Is it good? Was this the best painting you've ever seen? This is like exact replica of the Mona Lisa. And then behind her... I should have done the, I should have done the background first. Uh, seems to be like a river. So we're gonna have a river come in here. Oh no, and there's a river going into a hair. That was actually in it. That was actually in the real picture. There's a river going into a hair. There we go. So let's go ahead, let's save that. That is, wait, hold up. We forgot to give her, forgot to give her a, a mouth. We forgot to give her a mouth. Uh, we might also give her a little bit better eyes. Whoops, no! <laughs> um, She's not a Terminator, all right? She is not a Terminator. There we go, we're gonna make it cute. Um... <laughs> no, we don't laugh at art, guys. We don't laugh at art, all right? That's some wise words from the crayfish. We don't laugh at art. Let's save that. Uh, let's call it the Mona Lisa. I think that's how you spell it. If it's not, then awkward. Um, let's go ahead, let's open this up, let's start printing it out. And uh, let's have a look at this masterpiece. This is easily, 
easily 10 out of 10, probably better than the original, better than the original. This is probably better than the original. So let me know in the th let me know in the comments below what you think of this artwork when I actually put it up. Oh my god, this is this is beautiful. This is beautiful. I I got tears. I got tears. Oh my god, have a look at it. Have a look at it. It is beautiful. Let's pop it up on the wall here. Um, let's put it in our kitchen. We need to remember who is our one true. Um, one true lord here. It is the Mona Lisa. It is beautiful. It's actually a really good painting. It's actually a really good painting. It has a lot of emotion to it. it has a lot of emotion to it. Do you like it, young Greg? Oh god. He's he was staring it down there for a second. Do you like it? You do? Okay. Well I'll keep it up here for you. I'll keep it up for I'll keep it up here for you if you like it, because it it, it is a work of art. It is a work of art. But that, my friends, is going to end off this video today. Hopefully you enjoyed. Let me know what you think about this awesome new printer. Uh, if you have, again, ideas for it, let me know in the comments. And as well, if you haven't already, make sure you go ahead, snap that like button, subscribe, and also turn on your post notifications to get notified when I post new videos. And I'll see you guys later. Bye. I'm still here. I just went down just to look like it. Like I, I, all right. I thought it was a cool effect. I'm out.